Hey guys, Jonathan here, Colorado Custom Covers and Decks. Today we're doing a radius uh, deck out here on the corner. Just kind of want to go over some of the basics uh, of finding your radius and, and making your radius and making your cuts on your joists. So uh, first thing you got to find is what your circumference is going to be. This one's 11 foot 2. As you can see from our blue line here, out here, all the way across that blue line over there is 11 foot 2. And then from there you find your radius, which is just you just divide that in half which is five foot seven. So five foot seven comes right here where that pencil mark is. I don't know if you can see that or not, but right where my tape is. And then from there, we had a spring. There's a one foot two inch spring. So then from there, we mark up one foot two, which is this other blue line coming across here. So that's one foot two from our uh, circumference line across. And then from there, we carry our center point over, over here. So this right here is our center uh, center mark. And then from there, you just hook on and go across and make your marks on your joists. And uh, all you gotta do is when you mark your joist, so let's say, do a quick one here. Let's just do like five foot. So just kind of come across like that. Right across there, you make your marks. And then what I do is just find my, my angle of what that is. And so that's a 30 degree. So what I do is square down and cut that at 30 degrees on my saw. And each one of these are gonna be different. So this one here is a little bit steeper, it's 40. So uh, each one of these joists is a custom cut. Find your angle, cut it. Uh, make sure you take off an inch and a half for your uh, rim. Cause you know, that's gonna mess, you know, if you don't take that off, then you're gonna mess up. It's just gonna be a little bit bigger, I guess. So uh, usually it's not too big of a deal, but uh, so make sure you get that. And then in order to bend your rim, as you can see, we went through and made a bunch of uh, cuts here on the rim. I don't know if you can see that or not. We got a bunch of cuts here on the rim. And um, so this is just a small piece here. So we went in a pretty good inch and a quarter there about, inch and a half in between there, made our rips in there. The smaller the board, the more rips you have to do and the deeper you have to do to bend that thing around. Over here, you can see we didn't do as many rips because this is a full 16 foot board. So we didn't have to do as many but, um, but yeah, so that's kind of the basics of that, of doing a radius. So even if you're doing concrete, saying you got a radius for a pad, that you want to do is the same thing for your, your um, when you're forming it out, you got to make some rips in it to be able to get that bend in there. So just some basics on that. Hopefully this helps you out, guys. Thanks for watching. At Covers and Decks on Facebook. The Deck Answers on YouTube. Uh, Colorado underscore covers underscore decks on Instagram. Uh, check us out, follow us, you need a deck, you give us a call. Thanks guys.